coming up on today's episode of AMA Drone Report. FAA issues waivers to drones with parachutes. Know Before You Fly supporters urge Congress to fund education campaign. And Red Cat to acquire Rotor Riot. Welcome to Airborne's AMA Drone Report, a weekly news program covering the recreational drone world. In partnership with the Academy of Model Aeronautics, one of the oldest and most respected aviation organizations in the world, with more than 200,000 members and 2,400 clubs across the country. I'm Sophie Herlock. The FAA has issued Hensel Phelps Construction Company with a Part 107 waiver to operate a DJI Phantom 4 drone equipped with a parachute over people. A waiver is required to operate a drone contrary to the rules in Part 107. The FAA did not certify or approve the parachute that will be used. However, they determined the waiver application sufficiently met the standard design specification and the proposed small UAS operation could be conducted safely under the terms and condition of the waiver. This waiver represents the first time the FAA has collaborated with industry in developing a publicly available standard worked with an applicant to ensure the testing and data collected acceptably met the standard and issued a waiver using an industry standard as a basis to determine that a proposed small UAS operation could be conducted safely. This process is scalable and available to other applicants who propose to use the same drone and parachute combination. The FAA will require each applicant to provide testing documentation and statement of compliance listed in ASTM 3322-18 in their application using the same drone and parachute combination. In the next drone minute, let's take a brief look at a few short stories making rounds of the small UAS and hobby drone communities. AMA has awarded $20,240 to 45 clubs and 10 AMA districts across the nation. AMA awards up to $1,000 to clubs that implement a Take Off and Grow program in their local communities. TAG programs provide newcomers to model aviation an opportunity to learn about the hobby, as well as practice flying model aircraft with experienced club members. TAG grants are awarded each year thanks to support of the AMA members and AMA Foundation patrons across the country. Fox Fury Lighting Solutions has introduced the new Rugo 2 drone and camera light. The newest addition to the Rugo series is a lighting tool for the drone pilot. Powered by a rechargeable quick swap power pack, this 620 lumen light features a slide tri lens which allows the user to select between area, spot, and flood lighting. The Rugo 2 has four brightness levels and a CRI rating of 92. The strobe meets FAA 107.29 requirements for UAV night flight. DJI has named drone policy expert Mark Aitken to its Washington, D.C.-based advocacy team. Aitken is already at work as Director of U.S. Legislative Affairs responsible for helping ensure America can take full advantage of the benefits of drones. Mark joins DJI as the federal government addresses many legal and regulatory factors affecting how and where drones can be flown for personal and professional use. A bill under consideration by the New Hampshire Legislature would add small unmanned aircraft to the New Hampshire Aeronautics Act, making the state DOT the primary enforcement agency. The bill was originally sponsored by State Senator David Waters, who said small drones under 55 pounds need to be included in the state statute to allow the state to enforce federal regulations. This would make small drones equivalent to manned aircraft for the purposes of setting and enforcing rules. Now back to the rest of the news. Supporters of the No Before You Fly campaign have sent a letter to the House Committee on Appropriations urging Congress to provide funding for the campaign. The letter stresses the urgent need to educate the public and ensure the safety of the skies. 
as the regulatory framework for drones continues to change. It becomes even more important to educate the public about current laws and how to fly responsibly. The letter states, No Before You Fly would use these funds primarily through a reinvigorated digital and social media advertising campaign following the FAA's promulgation of new recreational rules. This will help raise awareness of new recreational rules and thereby increase compliance enhancing the safety of the airspace, which has been the campaign's mission since it launched. The letter is signed by founding partners of the campaign and 27 supporters. As a part of the FAA Reauthorization Act of 2018, Congress authorized $1 million to know before you fly and its public informational efforts to enhance UAS safety. The 2018 law also requires the FAA to implement new rules for recreational UAS operators, a process which the agency has already begun. Red Cat Incorporated has announced a letter of intent to acquire Rotor Riot. Red Cat became a founding member of the First Person View Freedom Coalition after the coalition's official launch as a 501c3 organization. As part of the coalition, Red Cat continues to advocate for airspace for recreational drone pilots and FPV operators, provides safety and education guidelines compliant with the FAA, and integrates the FPV community into the regulatory framework as an FAA community-based organization. We were looking for the perfect partner that could take our vision and platform to the next level, said Chad Capers, CEO and founder of Rotor Riot and president of the FPV Freedom Coalition. We have watched Red Cat take bold steps to innovate and push the drone industry forward. Based on our long-standing relationship, we believe that Jeff and the team will play an important ongoing role in ensuring that the tradition and culture fostered by FPV pilots is available to continue in a safe and transparent manner. That's our program for this week. If you're watching us on YouTube, please subscribe and do check us out on Facebook and on Twitter. Get comprehensive, real-time, 24-7 coverage of the latest aviation aerospace stories anytime at aero-news.net. And for more information on the exciting hobby drone world, check out modelaircraft.org.